Yeah, there's my, uh, the yard light out here in front of my mom's house. Uh, it's got a 40 watt bulb in it. Mom says it's too bright. So, I took another bulb. Just like it. I spray painted it white. <laughs> I'm going to put it in tomorrow and we'll see if it's, uh, I'll take another little video clip and see if it's still too bright for mom. We got robbed here back in June of 2007. They, they stole most of my power tools out of the garage. And I, oh, I was pissed, so I put a, well, here comes another damn car. Get out of here. I know that those cars sound terrible on this audio capture on this camera. Anyway, I was paranoid, so I put a 100 watt light bulb in that sucker. And I melted the damn thing. That's all plastic up there. That stuff that looks like glass, uh, it's plastic. And well, it was about like 10 days after, th you know, it melted, so I had to buy a new one and put up there. But about uh, 10 days after Thanksgiving this year, I get out there to put a blue light bulb. We always have the blue motif around here, all blue tree. Put a blue light bulb in that pole right there. And, uh, oh, that glass was so dirty on the inside. And it looked like vomit almost. It was just all the little bugs. They do their little droppings, and plus they die in there, and they, they just stick to the glass. And there's another car. Ah, damn those cars. And, uh, and so I brought them in and put them in a sink and scrubbed them down and, and then put the thing back together. And that's why this 40, 40 watt light bulb looking way too bright to suit mom. It, it, uh, says it shines in a window like a full moon and don't like it. So I'll take you upstairs and I'll show you the, the light bulb just like it that I've spray painted white. And for all I know, it's going to make it too bright. And I'm just going to say, Mom, you got to hunt you down a 25 watt light bulb. But I'm hoping, because I spray painted this bulb white, that it has the frosting effect. And it's like, it'll be a light frost. And and for all I know, I'm going to screw it in there. It's going to come on tomorrow night. <laughs> the paint's going to catch on fire. I don't know. I don't know if you're supposed to paint light bulbs. And, uh, in fact, the spray paint I dug up, I don't even know if it's latex or, uh, oil-based. If it's oil-based, I'm thinking we might have an inferno in the front yard out here tomorrow night. <laughs> Who knows? Ah, uh, I've rediscovered the majesty of ginger ale. Uh, tastes far much better than beer. <laughs> yes, it does. Yeah. Here's an exact replica of the light bulb I've got out in the front yard, except it's clear. I don't know. See? Uh, I don't know how to work lights. Uh, do -do -do. Got the tape here. I didn't want to get paint on the base. Uh, da, 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 da. Oh no! There's clear showing up in the bottom. Damn it to hell. I didn't think I overlapped the glass that much up there. Well, I'm going to have to put the paint back on. I mean the tape back on and how I was feeling so good. Feeling so good, I was drinking ginger ale instead of beer. <laughs> My invention here. I've got the tape back on it. I've got to take it back out to the garage and spray paint that. I'll be right back. I called for some more ginger ale. I mean. Went out there, covered that up, and just went ahead and gave the whole thing a double coat. And I'll be letting it dry up. Got it here in my handy dandy quick grip clamp. 
Yes, sirree. There it is. Drying away in the clamp. Okay. We'll see how that works. I'm only going to let this one dry until tomorrow evening. And, uh, put it in the pole, see if we got that nice frosty look. Yeah, uh, you see, I think there should be more light out there. And, uh, but Ma don't. It's been long enough since we got robbed. She likes it to look more undertoned. And, uh, up the street there's this rich guy. He's got a light pole and he's got a propane tank back behind the house and he's got a tube buried and it goes to that light and it's uh, got a little gas light flickering flame he can make it turn it up and make it bigger but he keeps it low when she goes like I like that and I go like mom that ain't, that don't even put out any light it almost looks like a match blowing in the wind. Just a little flame going like this. A little propane flame. I don't know. But we'll see if my invention hanging there, drying, if that's going to work. Who knows? Oh, man. Well, that gripes my butt. What we got here is a failure to communicate. My mom comes up here, go to her sewing room. Got a little sewing room over there. She makes stuff, sews, and uh, she says, what do you got that thing hanging on the light for? And I go like, that's my thing to try to get you a bowl that's not too bright out there. You, you won't buy me a 25 watt, you can't find them. And she's like, I've got a couple 25 watts down there. I said, what? What? Why do you tell me? It's too cold. I knew you'd try to get up in that pole and you'd freeze your fingers off. I don't know how many times I gotta tell her. My hands do not get cold and feel like falling off. It might be cold to her, but it's not that cold to me. I froze these things solid when I was a paper boy, when I was in grade school. I can take cold. Anyway. 25 watts. There's a 25 on there. 25 watts. Okay. Mm -hmm. Here I am. I'm dying of paint fumes. My cats got out of the garage. And, uh, I dropped the camera. And, uh, it Apparently it knocked the clip out of it. When I dropped it, it, it was, I had just turned it off and it was blinking processing. That knocked the clip out of my camera of me doing the spray painting. And the LCD screen doesn't work on it now. But I have uh, reviewed a few of the earlier clips and they're good. It's just my LCD screen's off now. Or whatever you call it, your little view screen. Uh, 25 watts, and I think they're going to be too bright. How many retardo doofus, redneck drunk loser guys does it take to put a light bulb in? We're going to see right now. Come on! The thing, the Rocky! I did it, Adrian! I did it! I did it! Down here you see uh, that thing there, that's the photoelectric cell right there. 
So I'm going to put some black tape over it, simulate darkness. This thing will come on in a while, and I'll get you a daylight video clip. Of course, the true test is tonight. All right, it came on. It's got a little bit of like an orange glow to it. I, I, if I'm not mistaken, that's got a, a really nice frosty uh, lower wattage looking U to it. I checked the light bulb, Adrian. I did it. I did it. Adrian. Adrian, I changed the light bulb. Ain't gonna be no rematch. Ain't gonna be no rematch. Ugh. Okay, I think something's gonna happen bad. I can really smell that spray paint. Oh, man. Yeah, Houston, I, I do. That's a confirmation there. I do smell paint fumes coming off that painted light bulb. Advise. You say, do not abort. Do not abort the emission. Do not abort. Okay. Yes, I, I do believe it's letting up. I think it's it's actually cooked the painting on there. The paint on the light bulb. I think it's cooked. Uh, how much longer on this test, Houston? You say set a watch right now for your chronographer for five minutes. Will do. Godspeed. All right, five minutes went by. Bulb is still burning. Doesn't appear there's gonna be any fire go on, so I'm gonna remove this uh, black electrical tape. Now the photo, the photo sensor will see that it's light outside. And the light bulb will go off here in a little bit. Probably not while this video's going because it takes it a while and I've not got much time left on this memory card here. I can only do like a two, three minute clips and then another 90 second one. Maybe. Oh, it just went off. It went off. It, the photo electric cell told it it was daylight. So we'll see you tonight and we'll see if it passes my mommy's test if it looks too light. Okay. It's the next night. I've got that light bulb in there that I've been bragging about. As you can see, here comes a car. It's got an orange. It's way, way, way more or less light than the way it was. You can't really tell from this thing. And here comes another car. Okay. Well, I'll get down in the yard and take another clip of it up close, but I mean there's hardly any light coming out of this And I think my mom's verdict is like Not enough light. I never would have known that you could spray paint a light bulb white and Then there's another car and and then the uh, The light bulb end up looking orange like this. I don't know but it it does put out more light than that guy thing up up the street that's got that that propane little actual burning flame. So I don't know. I'm thinking I'm gonna have to put the 25 watt bulb that's clear in there. But I really want to play around and do another one of these, but put some black electrical tape. At least some clear spots. And I also want to do that with the 25 watt bulbs too. I mean, let's, let's, I mean, let's face it. I'm a light bulb technology guy now. I can't help it. I've got to do this. It's the way I am. It's either this or be a beer drinking technologist. Alright? Okay.